because, uh... Oh, see, like there. I missed that jump. Which will throw everything off. Like, I could... There's ways around that, but it causes a few seconds loss. Then when I get in the mountains, I wouldn't get the spawns I'm expecting. So, I'd get different spawns, so then my guy wouldn't power up enough. I'm not sure if, how familiar you are with Rygar in general, but your guy starts out super weak. But with every enemy you kill, you get what's called tone. And uh, the more tone you get, the stronger you get. That's kind of the RPG element of this game. And, uh... So if my spawns aren't what I'm expecting as I'm going through the mountains here, I won't get the tone I'm expecting for when I fight the first boss later on. So that's why right away I can tell it's like, oh, that's... You're better off just resetting than trying to go through with different stuff than what you're used to or what you know will work. Because... Then when you get Monkey Wrench thrown at you, sometimes you can work it out and it's okay. But when it's you're going for this fast a pace... You trying to figure out something new or different... Causes three second loss here, five second loss there, and... Pretty soon you have no way of getting your goal. Oh yeah, yeah, no problem. Yeah, I just uh, a lot more fun if you know what's going on. So I'm trying to kind of, at least for me. So a lot of times I'll know the game, but I don't necessarily know the speed run. So like there, it's faster to get the grappling hook and die than to walk all the way back. Yep, I'm three seconds off. We actually had a run last night I streamed, and uh, my last run of the night, three seconds away from world record, and I went back crying and looked at the video, that uh, slow down in the spider cave with the lag cost three seconds. <laughs> So it's like, if I did everything like I did last night, which wasn't even perfect, I would have been right on tied with the world record. Yeah, it's just, uh, like a lot of Nintendo games, there's one part where I do a trick where I want an uh, enemy to follow me for a while, and then I jump off, and it's called the bug jump, because the enemy looks like a bug. But what happens sometimes is a whole bunch spawn on top of each other, and then that whole time you're running, it lags. And I found out that uh, if you have lag that whole run, it actually slows it down by three seconds. Which, ironically, is uh, exactly what I was short on for tie-in world record.
that is a gold split. That, that means that's the best I have ever done. And it's gold. So that was a very good fight. And a very good split. Now we just need to play it cool through the... Coming up on the actual hardest parts of the run. Yeah, the key to that boss fight is you want to hit him five times before he spits his fireball at you. It's really tough too. that Sesame Street. And I may as well. Yeah. I wanted to kill that many because uh, my tone was so high. That'll make the spider fight easier. Gotta perform here. Tricky stuff. Genuine bear or genuine bear? <laughs> I'm terrible at that. And yeah, we're on good pace. The only bad thing about this right now is I don't have any health. Hoping for lots of health drops actually in the grind. Because, uh, typically take one shot. I want to get up to three health. Otherwise, I may have to go the high tone route. Because, uh,. drops on the German grind here. So now we're going to grind on these green guys. Try to power up huge for the rest of the run. Hopefully while we're doing it, they'll drop in at least three jars. Then a couple three packs of stars. Okay, 
terrible. You don't want that guy doing that stuff. Of red guys spawning and lagging it down, and it was going okay, but I kept getting stars instead of jars. So I had to go the different route, which is all right. We're just going to be doing some different strats. And yeah, it's going to look like a big loss, but. key now is, oops, is I want to get a three pack of stars. If I get a three pack of stars and have a really good fast tower and a good air walk, we still can uh, world record. But I have to have a very good tower. I'm not going for a health pickup. Yeah, it did seem really slow. That's where Sesame Street comes to bite you, because uh, had I not taken all that damage in Sesame Street, I wouldn't have been so dependent on getting all those jars. Right, so as long as this death pigger doesn't, uh... Ah, That hurt. packs of stars, maybe picking up a couple jars, and we're going to do what's called the giant air walk. We can do that quickly. We get a three pack. Oops, jar. I'd rather get a three pack. I could have complained about a jar at this point. Differences, uh, because I won't be going up and getting health at all. You can go straight up here and get a health refill.
Time for someone to come up to bed. Yeah. Hear that, Iris? Time for you to go up. Yeah. Okay. Hold on, I'm doing the big air walk with Iris. You better go up. Okay, that was an okay or walk, slow start. That was a good finish. Now we just need stars. Okay, good night, honey. Love you. Come on, a spicy run here, honey. Not getting any help. <laughs> Man, I don't think I can. Usually you pick up some type of star drop there. Oh, what am I at? Two or three? Hopefully we get a fast Belvedere and we'll see. Yeah. That run went sour quick, but technically we're still on world record pace if we get a three pack. Three pack. All right, that changes everything. Changes everything. chance. We have a good... We have a good Ligar fight. We got a chance. As long as we just uh, execute the castle the way we're supposed to. to a good fight. Oh, a star. If you would have given me a jar, that would have been, like, awesome.
Jesus, we got world record. <laughs> we did it. <laughs> okay, the high tone strat was good. <laughs> wow. That's the first sub 21. That's world record. <laughs> you got to see it, Saber. <laughs> Woohoo! World record, bam! Happy birthday, record holder! Thank you for the GG's, Mia! <laughs> Thank you! Oh, we got a. The door of peace was open, and peace did again come to our ghoul! People regained their smiling faces! The warrior who finished the fight returned! Warrior of Argus, you are really a true hero! <laughs> Hey, Pipes! <laughs> Glad you could be here! Thanks, man! Thanks for the GG's! Thanks, Saber! Juice, you're right! That, uh... <laughs> Alright, that uh, calls for some juice. Juice. <laughs> wow! And who knows? Wow! Thank you again! Woohoo! Wow. <laughs> yeah. Man, yeah, that was, uh, yeah, I was thinking I was totally out of it, but that three pack at the end, that saves the day in this run. Wow. And I kind of, I was going back and forth between low tone and high tone strats, and I knew I was low on health, so I'm like, well, we'll just tone up and go for it. <laughs> Didn't even need the final jar. Yeah, because I was so high-toned. Well, and I got a good fight. Sometimes Ligar is a jerk, and he'll hit you with uh, one of his butterflies, like, right after your tenth one, but he actually hesitated long enough for me to get it. Oh, man. That was... <laughs> That's the first sub-21.